a blocked shot. Is it luck? Is it good timing? Is it anticipation? Bill Russell, the man who not only popularized it, but had it down to an exact science. Bill Russell, the old Boston Celtics, now the coach of Seattle Supersonics, what is a shot block? What is a block shot? Well, I call it action, because it's not a reaction. You can't, when you block a shot of reaction, then you're lucky. In other words, it's just jumping ability. There's more to it than that. I was explained to Bob a minute ago. Just Bob McAdoo of the Buffalo Braves. Trying, everybody Pretty good knows shooter. Him. Everybody knows him. Yeah, I know him. Too. <laughs> no, what I mean is now, for a guy, example, a guy like him, if I just play him straight away, there's no way I'm going to stop him. Okay, so now going to his right, it's two or three points every time. It's a dunk shot, a layup, or two free throws. <laughs> it, so what I would try to do with a guy like Bob, I'd overplay him. He's got the ball. I'd overplay him here. So now what I've done is I've taken away him going to the right. And I'm close enough so if he puts it on the floor, I can knock it loose. So I'm making him dribble with his left hand. So that's the reason I'm so close to him here, is to make him go with his left hand dribbling, so that's slowing him down a little bit. Now, if I let him go all the way, the hoop will dunk it, though. So that means i got to stay ahead of him. And the idea is to slide here, slide here, and wait. Now, but what I did is I eliminated half his options by taking away his right. Now, the idea is, when I go up to block the shot, I'm going to try to sweep it that way. Sweep it. You don't slap it. No, no. Now, see, now, if I sweep it there, now i got an angle to go after it. In other words, Bill Russell was trying to say that when he plays one man, man to man, and wants to shut him off and block his shot, he studies that man. It's not a matter of letting the man make his move and then blocking the shot. Actually, you're blocking his shot before he starts his play. Now, when he goes to the left over there, as you had him, and he came up for the shot, as soon as his feet left the ground, Bill Russell knows he's committed. Right. Then you yourself can leave your feet. All right, dribble right across the center and take a jump shot. Russell's going to play you. Let's see how he plays you relative to blocking the shot. Go ahead. All right. I'd like to play basketball and have that character right in front of you with those long Now, on that play, he's, he's well, trying to give me a break. He's giving me a break, but uh, on right. that play. Do it, do it quick for the old Don't man. Don't tell him that. Do it quick. No, what I'm trying to do, see what I do, keep my hand up. You made him miss. I fouled him. <laughs> no, 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 don't, 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 ever, say that. don't ever admit that you fouled anybody. <laughs> <laughs> I can't buy that at all. Don't ever admit that. Well, no, see, oh, what I'm trying to do Come is, on. Now, for example, when he gives me a fake, he gives me a fake, I put my hands up, and I leave him up. You yeah, see? but you still got your knees a little right. bit, right? Now, say he gives me a fake. I keep my hands up. He's still shooting over my hands. Oh, in other words, what Bill Russell was trying to say is when his hands are up and he jumps, he does not bring his hands down to jump up a little higher. All he has to do is intimidate Bill Russell, the greatest of them all. He dominated NBA centers for 13 years. Not only that, he intimidated the entire offensive flow of the game. Later today, at halftime of the second game, Bill Russell, along with Tiny Archibald and Bob McAdoo, will show you exactly how he did it. 